Hi, this is Darman. Welcome to another Minecraft Let's Play video. In this video series, I'm showing you how to build Stampy's lovely world. And to my left is what we built, finished building in the last one. The Rule the Duel uh, game came out awesome. I love it. It's a fun game to play. I think everybody enjoys that one. And right around the corner, we're going to stay in the fun land today. I know a couple of people have been asking to get uh, back to the town. And, uh, and we will, but uh, it, just, it, it just occurred to me that the, I have made an egregious error which is that we have not built this rainbow ride yet. And uh, as I mentioned in the last video, there are several rides that do not work anymore. And uh, unfortunately, this is one of them, but you just can't not build it because it is just this huge rainbow and it's a big landmark and you could potentially make it work. You could. Uh, I'm going to show you how it's built and I'll, I'll try to give you a few suggestions on, you know, maybe how to make it work, you know, not as quite as it did maybe, but to get some sort of enjoyment out of it in other words anyway so we're going to get right to it and uh so we're going to use a multitude of colors as you can see in my hot bar down there and we are going to locate our our entrance for this by looking uh we're to the left of the uh, sharky shark game here uh right in front of the uh what is this thing i don't even remember the raging rapids and the uh something or other thing that's broken up there the other thing that's broken uh, so how about that? Uh, let me just fly here. Let me get, here we go. Uh, so we're going to start at this corner and we're going to work towards our left and go to the 17th block. That is no, no 19th block. That's going to be our, uh, starting point for the path. And, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. We're going to put a magenta down there. And we're going to go five to the left of that and put another magenta. So we're going to leave four open here uh, and then just put another magenta there just to mark our, that's our complete entrance there. Uh, so I'm going to start on the, uh, there's an, the inside building, inside edge of the building here. And uh, it, I have them, I have the uh, colors here in a very specific order because this is the order that he has them in. So, uh, so we're going to start with uh, magenta, then purple, oops, then blue. No, no, sorry. Here, this is the one of the only times that it, it actually sort of changes. So it's magenta, purple, then magenta again. And then we follow the pattern of purple, blue, green, yellow, orange, red. And we want to get back to one block away from that thing. Uh, so we're just going to keep repeating this pattern until we do so. Uh, so we got red, red, orange. This is actually um, right here. This red one is actually the last one that's out in the open. The next ones are are part of the building. So uh, just kind of keep that in mind. So we've got the magenta, purple, blue, oops, green, uh, yellow, orange, red, and then we've got uh, back to the beginning. Magenta, purple, blue, green should be the last one. Yep. So we're one block away from here, which is good. And we're lined up just like you see here. There's this path here and one block away. And then we have this sucker right here. Uh, so this is uh, it's a total of six blocks wide. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then it's going to go back. So there should be, uh, you know, four blocks in between the two edge pieces. In other words, this is, this is going to go this way. Uh, so there should be, it should be four blocks wide inside. So we're just going to duplicate, uh, the colors that are over here, but I'm going to, I'm going to start over here with, um, actually I'm going to start with this, this here, uh, because this will follow our, our pattern more closely. So we've got uh, purple, um, blue, and this is one of the few times where the color across from it does not is not the same and and that's just the way it is it's fine uh i had to make a choice at some point it, it all work, basically works out uh so green yellow orange red and then one more blue so that should make it a total of eight uh one two three four five six seven eight yep yeah. uh and so then we're just going to connect these guys up he should line up perfectly now uh so we left off at blue so we're just going to continue the pattern with green yellow orange red back to the beginning magenta purple blue green yellow orange red back to the beginning magenta purple gr uh blue green if i say the name of the color wrong just put the color that i'm putting down how about that <laughs> I just realized this is just inevitable. Um, I'm just going to complete this across magenta, purple, blue, and then green would be our next one. And that's correct like that. So all these colors here should match up perfectly. Uh, and it looks like they do. So that's great. 
and uh, so now we have that marked out let's do uh, let's do this floor here and most of it um, this part that I'm in right now this tunnel this is gonna be all the, the, the colors are just gonna follow across uh, that's nice and easy it, over here uh, in this section it goes the opposite direction so we're gonna just uh, do that section first and the rest um, you can just let you do that part by yourself it's easy enough I'll just set you up with some instructions and you're gonna be good to go and now that I have exposed all this lovely water which is completely covered this area that's how we're gonna do it so we're gonna start uh, uh, we're gonna we're gonna follow this color on the left and that's just because the first time I built this I did Perp, you know, magenta, purple, magenta, magenta, and I put that across. That was that's not the way to do it because it's it's blue. So we want to make sure we follow these colors uh, going across. Uh, this should be four going across each one, uh, just like in the other one. And we're just going to bring this across, you know, right to here. We're gonna we're gonna stop here. We're just the four, and uh, let's just complete this part. Okay, just like that. And then now we can turn the corner and just go you know this way doing the, the exact same thing starting with magenta and uh, working our way across with four across all the way down there okay that part is good uh so we're going to go and find the part where the tunnel starts which is right here on this middle uh magenta one and uh, this one is the one two three four five six seventh block here and this marks the beginning of the tunnel uh the tunnel is the, the sides are four blocks high and then there's a middle part that goes up one more block so we go uh one two three four and the other side one two three four that high and then temporarily just put one there and get rid of it and then just pull it across and we're gonna bring there right to there and, and this for this one only we we have this extra bit here that's just to keep the water and the rest of these don't don't have anything like that uh, so just go ahead and just you know duplicate this for uh, the other colors of our rainbow and that's the basics of that uh, I'm not gonna put the water in yet because we need to uh, deal with some more situations down here so we built this nice and perfect and symmetrical all the way down to here but now uh, sadly I must destroy just a few things and let's see so we're going to take out just these on the first three you know these uh, purple green uh, blue and green we're gonna bring them all the way down to the dirt and uh, so then we're gonna take this this magenta and we're gonna break the ground and put one block of that here and then we're gonna go and take let's see what is it purple and we're gonna break out three blocks here and then we're gonna do the same thing with the blue and this is where the glass elevator is gonna go uh, that's what we're doing here so these there's two there for the green and that's gonna do it uh, so at this point it's just a matter of uh, it's just glass going up uh, before we get to that we let's uh we need a couple of more pieces of wool and that's inside here we need one purple uh up here and a blue one up here like this uh, and that's really just to keep water in the way it's supposed to be and let's uh do some torches down here i think that would be good before I forget uh, so if we're looking at this green wall we're gonna put two at the top here don't you can't put one in the corner because what we're gonna do is put ones uh, right on each color on the inside and this is gonna be extremely well lit and um, and colorful and bright and we're gonna do the same thing out here right at the top uh, just put on each like that uh, now there's gonna be uh, glass on these first uh, four so we're not gonna be able to have those but we can put on the rest but not there <laughs> no sneaky little torch not there uh and then across this backside, all the way wow that was interesting <laughs> you know it's supposed to happen but that is not it and it's hard to get these to destroy these now it's like they're so tiny used to be just anywhere in the block you could do that okay there we go uh no need a second yeah not on that green not on that green uh it actually goes the red one gets it there uh, and then these three and then these and um, there we go 
rid of these random ones in the beginning. And uh, since we don't need, well, I don't need this right now. We do need uh, a double chest here, uh, right in the front. This is where we would keep uh, the boats. And uh, so in, in the old, there's no sign, by the way. In the olden days, there was a, um, you know, when it worked, you would just get the boat, come in here, and paddle yourself into this glass tower, which we're about to build, and it would automatically suck you up, and you would just... Um, come out and it was just all it was all automatic and it just you didn't have to do anything which was great but things have changed the boat physics have changed so this is the part where you need to make some decisions about what you want to do and if you just want it to look exactly like stampies uh, then that's exactly what you're working i'm going to show you how to do if you want to make some modifications now might be the time to start thinking about how you want to do this uh, one option is to not ride a boat up the elevator you could um, you could just make this into a walking thing. You walk right into a bubble elevator, which is uh, you take soul sand and then you put uh, you know water blocks above it, and then you know you know the process for that is just you, you would just shoot straight up, and uh, once you get to the top, maybe you grab the boat there and then figure out a way to get it to ride down. The current configuration of the clouds will not get you to the rainbow. It will not, unfortunately. So there would be some modifications uh, needed for that. But uh, you can have some fun really trying to figure out uh, more ways. In fact, I thought about there's there's two clouds that you jump down to get to the rainbow. And I'm thinking, like, if you had a third one, I think that would pretty much solve the problem. And um, uh, the boats also don't work quite as, as they used to. You, they won't just glide along quite as easily. You have to, But if you push forward, which you couldn't really do before... Um, it, it, they'll actually go faster and it'll, it'll probably work. So anyway, we'll deal with that. So we need to build a tower here. And this was always the most mysterious part of this build is exactly how tall this tower is. And uh, I went to Stampy's World and worked it out uh, very specifically for that. Um, but you can sort of figure it out from watching his videos because you can see like in his hot bar how many materials he has and how many he uses up. And But it's, it, it's not easy to do. So I'm going to tell you that right now, the number you're looking for is 142 glass blocks. Um, so we're not gonna uh, we're not gonna go through all of them here, but uh, just let's just set up you know where they're supposed to go, and that's on these you know put these two on the green, one on the blue and the purple here, one on the magenta here, one on the magenta up here, and then two on the roof like this. So this is our you know, if you were to bring them all up to the same level, you would see this is just a, it offers you a two by two square of water to climb up. And, um, you know, the, the, the boats are just not going to climb up the way it's currently designed. It's just, it just doesn't work that way anymore. So you end up with this, uh, which is the part we're going to continue up. Uh, so I'm going to continue this up, uh, make this uh, glass area exactly 142 blocks tall, and I will see you when you're done. Whoa, we we are up high. This is, I think, I think it is possibly still one of the highest things in his world, if not the highest. Uh, 142 blocks standing up here is uh, no joke. It's no joke up here. So we can see all of our lovely handiwork we've done so far, and uh, we can see we can see nearly the entire map, like the original map. Like I can see beyond, you know, into the parts that the the game has added on to the sides, but beyond that. We can see nearly the whole the whole lovely world from up here. So uh, now I'm going to I'm still flying. I, anybody who's not doing this in creative, if you're doing this in survival mode, I, I sincerely hope you have uh, uh, put some water down at the bottom to keep yourself uh, from dying multiple times while building this, because this would take uh, quite a while and be pretty scary up here. Uh, so now that we've built this perfect 142 block tower, I'm going to act ask you to smash two of these uh, the ones that are on the side of the rainbow house down there I don't know what else we're gonna call that uh, we're gonna take these two off right here and uh, then we're gonna start our cloud building right from here so we're gonna take some white wool and the very first thing we're gonna do is build a we're gonna kind of extend this tower to them to the total height that it's going to be uh, so we're going to put four on this uh, this one that I just told you to destroy part of four one two three four and, uh, and on the other ones, we're going to put six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just going to do that to all of them. These are, if 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 nothing else, 
having this part of the tower, you know, these little pieces we're putting on now, this will give you the final height of, um, you know, the, the entire water channel that comes up here. Um, so if, even at this point, if you're going to do a different cloud design, you wanted to do something different, you, you know, this is what you need because this, this is going to be, this is going to end up being the, you know, the height that you're going to, you know, come out and start, you know, going down this ride. Uh, so, you know, if you were planning on doing a different cloud design than Stampy, then, you know, you could, you could do so, uh, at this point, I think, uh, we just have to make sure we keep this part, uh, open, uh, up, up to here. And, uh, so, you know, and if you do decide to do a, you know, a, you know, you do a walk up and then use the bubble elevators to get up to here, then eh, you probably have to decide, you know, maybe how to maybe store your boats or keep them, you know, little doors, you know, something with a roof and a door. So you come out and then you get into a boat or I don't know, I don't know how you're going to do it, but, um, I may try to do one myself and another, maybe, maybe I'll make a copy of this world and then just, um, try and see if I can get something that at least sort of works once we're all done. We still have to build the rainbow. We're not going to get anywhere near that today. Uh, so let's just build this, uh, let's just build this cloud that we have, uh, up here. We're going to start right at the bottom of this, these two walls that, you know, the ones that stick down farther like that, because again, we want to make sure we're over top of that uh, rainbow building down there. Uh, we want to put four blocks coming out this way. Uh, one, two, three, four, and then on the side, just put three, uh, not one here. Just leave that open, and that's the very bottom layer of the. Tower. I should have mentioned we're going to build from the bottom up. That's that's the plan. Should have built. Should have, should have probably mentioned that. Uh, so that's it. So next layer is we are going to fill. Uh, the, actually, I think what I'm going to do is just have you. Um, I'm going to have you double up everything that's here, and then we'll add on bits to each oops to oh, stop that to each side okay so now it's now it's doubled so now we want to you know we definitely want to fill these two little guys in here and uh let's see let me start from this way because i have you can't see but i have pictures in front of me and uh they all come from this angle so i'm just gonna sort of go from here so basically to these these to these four that we have here we want to add uh three blocks you know out this way so one two three one two three one two three one two three and then if we come to the side we want to just skip that first block and put it blocks all the way back to here should be seven one two three four five six seven yep that's good there so then these uh these you know stair back stair back not stair s-t-a-r-e but stair as in the stairs we climb on um i just think of that you know that uh, that sort of zigzag zigzag pattern as a stair um, it's uh, sideways i know that i know i'm, I'm a lunatic uh so we're gonna go to the side again and uh, skip that first one again and just bring it uh, again one short on this side so this should be five one two three four five that's right so we want to do the exact same thing over here now uh, i'm saying to do the exact same thing uh, how long do i have to take that back to here back to here um some of this is not symmetrical one two three four five six seven M most of it is there's a couple of blocks that are a little off and uh you can decide for yourself if you want to have it that way um that's the way he's got it so we're just going to do it uh, i'm going to show you how to do it that way as i normally would Okay, so that is the next level. So we're on, uh, let's see, that's the second level we just did. And we still have not had yet to uh, add any back here, and that's fine. We're going to do so on the uh, on this next level. So again, let's, uh, let's just double this up. And um, yeah, his whole, the whole cloud is solid, by the way. I did, I did check that. I thought, is it, like, is it completely solid? Is there space in there? uh no it is uh it is solid wool so for you non-creative players i hope you've hope you've got enough wool. if you anybody who's not doing this in creative you you're gonna need like 16 million tons of wool so i, I sincerely you've probably figured that out by now so i, I hope you have a, a good sheep farm going uh a wool farm anyway and if you need a wool farm in my other series i'm, I'm about i just uh, uploaded a series a, a video on um on having one anyway shining shameless self plug there for my other series for my for my survival series anyway so from here let's go around to the front again and starting on the right we're gonna add three one two three 
And here we're going to add three. One, two, three. And here we're only going to add two because we want to start this line going across. And we're going to add uh, one here, one here, and then again, even that out there. One, two, three to even that part out. And one, two here, which, yeah, this, this is just one of those times where it's not symmetrical. If you wanted it to be symmetrical, you could put this here. Um, but it, it is not, this is, this is the way it is at this, this particular level. Uh, so then on the sides, we want to add three, but it's going to be like the six block back. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So we're going to add three here. So I guess you could just say, come one block away from here and add the three there. It looks like that's the way that one works out there. So then on the back, we want to add, this is the first time we're adding some back here. I'm just going to add two to each of these except for the last one. Two here, two here, two, 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 two. And then there would, I would normally say two here, but it's going to be one. Yep. That's just the way it goes here. Um, that's just, that's it. That's, that's it. If symmetrical, you would add two there, but we've got just one. I think those are the only two play. I think this is really the only couple of play two places where we have to do something a little bit different, but that's okay. Uh, all right, so we are going to double all this up and add some more to the next layer. So let's just get this fired up here. And once you have it all doubled, uh, we're going to actually come back into the front and take out the four here and leave, leave the end ones here. Uh, leave that there. They, they, it's actually going to be uh, pressure plates here. Uh, sure, why not? We can put them in here. Why not? Just so we keep track, make sure we've got those there. Then we need to put one more on each of these little uh little things sticking out on the side and on the right side we want to bring this out one and on this side we need to bring it out two because we want these all to be lined up here now because this was that was where that that one that's missing is uh so we do want to uh, make sure that's out to here that's good and we want to add one on each side of these little little outcroppings here And then we're going to start on, I'm sorry, I'm just coming around this side because this is, again, the way my little drawing is. Uh, so from here, we want to put two here, two here, two here. But now we we'll only put one and one because we want this to go across. Uh, put, oops, uh, two, yeah, two there. Um, there's three, no, I'm sorry, four. Yeah, two there, four there. Four going across, I should say. Uh, and then we're going to add two here. And then we're going to add three here, one, two, three, so that this is symmetrical, even though this thing under here was not symmetrical. And we already added the one on the outside there. And so, yep, yeah, that's, uh, that's good. And the next layer is actually almost identical, except uh, it, it, it is for the, pro, the, the overall outline. Um, but we're going to make, this is where we need to start making the sides uh, come up a little bit. So we are going to... Go, uh, first we're going to add ones here like that. And then we're going to take, I'm starting back here. Actually, you know, maybe we'll do it this way. We'll start right here on this little nub here and we're just going to go all the way back and, and fill this in. This is just doubling this up here. And then we're going to do the flip around and do the exact same thing on this side. And we just want to start leaving that channel open again, that, you know, this little bit in here and double this one up. And this here, and we'll get back to that in a second. We're just going to double this up first, and then we're going to go back and, oops, and add, um, whoops, we're going to add one, <sighs> add one to the, each of this thing here uh, on both sides, but do it in a much better way than I am. That, that, that's what I would recommend. Okay, there we go. So this, this is what we've got so far, and this this is nice and accurate. We love this, and we love this. I'm making judgments for myself. How about that? That's messed up. How messed up my head is. So for this next one, we're gonna uh, start here. Instead of right on the uh, nib here, this thing sticking out. We're gonna go one back from there, and then we're gonna go one block past this one here. Uh, then we're going to go again, come back here, skip that first one, bring it all the way back here. And then, you know, 
just you know one short of that one as well and then we're just going to double up this one here and then that's it we don't have to go out any farther uh, in that direction so let's do that exact same thing over here uh, come back one from there one block farther here and one block away from there and then one block short on this side double this up uh, we can fill these in back here and then we just want to you know, make a nice neat little you know symmetrical uh, piece back here that just you know continues each one being one but one block shorter on each side uh, like that and then we're going to rotate a little bit and see these three that are right here we're going to start on the middle one and we're going to go five blocks in this direction one two three four five and then we're going to skip that first one and do another five one two three four five and then do another exactly like that in the same spot uh, like that and come around and do the exact same thing here. One, two, three, four, five. Skip this one. One, two, three, four, five. And double that one up there. So this one should be one block shorter on each end uh, on that last side. And then I think we just got a little bit more. You know, we just have three more little blocks to put here, which would line up with these three here. Uh, to there. And uh, right here. And that's it. that is our little cloud done look at that we've got an official stampy cloud um right here um on in his where this little notch is we're gonna put on the bottom here we're gonna put uh four signs that are just kind of sitting there uh and this is just to keep uh the water back because the water doesn't i don't know it sort of reaches out to here but it's 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 really really thin by the time it gets here so i think he wanted to have a a larger stream of water you know stop here and, and begin here and this is the first place where it starts to die uh, it, it used to be that you just flowed straight across all this but now when you get to here it starts to kind of funk down and then it starts to slow down and it's it's not good so this is the first thing that i would you know if you were trying to rework this i would take this out and start experimenting with ways to get more water flowing through here uh, that that's that's what I'd recommend uh, speaking of signs I have to put uh, let's see ones right here at this uh, not anything on them but at this this level here and then we're gonna put another one right on front of that or you just just point at that sign and then place another sign and it it, it kind of understands that this is a block here and it's putting it on the next block uh, so I'm just gonna put one on that side and then repeat it and then that creates that position uh, okay so the water let's uh, you know i'm going to show you how he did it and again you can decide what you want to do uh i'm not going to fill this in up quite yet but his system is uh was built with signs that held back blocks of water uh diagonally and the way that what i mean is uh let's put a sign right here on the second magenta uh, block right here and then two over here on this glass and then two up here and i think those are the last oh and then one more here uh and that will keep the water in and it will actually allow us to do uh the pattern that he he intends to do so that means the first block of water is going to be right here uh which obviously uh we've you know what let's just put the rest of this water back here i'm just gonna i'm just gonna it's gonna fill in all this this water down here and then if i put one here that'll fill all the rest of that in nicely or so there we go okay so now it's not not pushing me around at all uh so that that block will stay nice in here because this um this sign it essentially takes up this whole block so it you know and same here and same here so we uh you know as far as minecraft is concerned this block is you know this water is blocked in here and um the same thing will happen if I put this here. It's just going to sort of magically look like it's sort of floating. Um, although you can waterlog wine uh, signs now. You can put signs inside blocks. Like if I put a block of water here, it would actually go there. Um, I don't want to do that though. So at this point, the pattern would be uh, just to alternate. So you've got a sign and then skip and then so it, um, you know, put it. Oh, where's my? Oh, here we go. Uh, so you know, skip that one. Skip, you know. It, this is just a little tedious because of you know it wants you to type something but that's okay uh so then like you know down here again you just just alternate these uh stagger them and maybe it's the word to use uh and then 
then the thing is you have to do the opposite of whatever this is over here. So if this is a sign here, no sign over there. So that's why this is set up this way. There's a sign here, but no sign over here. Uh, I feel like I'm, hopefully I don't, don't feel like I'm talking down to you. Uh, and there has to be a sign here as well. We didn't put that down initially. So uh, once you have that pattern, uh, so there's a sign here and there's no sign over there. There we go. So this pattern is, is working. So you'll have to just, um, if this is the way you're going to do it, uh, just go ahead and do it however you want. I'm going to do it this way and I'll see you when I'm done. Wow. So how much fun was that? That was <laughs> so fun. <laughs> um, I needed to tell you though, how far up do you need to go here? Uh, not, not quite all the way up, uh, here, obviously here you can only go, uh, up to here, but on this side, you just need to uh, have one more, uh, if you can, if it makes any sense, this, this block here that I'm looking at goes all the way across to where this sign is. So you just need to have one more sign above that for, for the rest of this to, to work out. Uh, so I'm just going to take, um, oh, I didn't put my, I didn't put, all right, let's just pretend <laughs> that I, that I actually put water in all the places that I was supposed to put, oh dear, uh, I did not put it, I'm not supposed to put it there. Um, I take this out, put a little block in there, get rid of it, put my sign back in. There we go. And, uh, there we go. So these are the, let's pretend they're all filled up all the way down to there. Uh, so at this point up to here, we just need to add a uh, block of water. This would be here. And then we could add uh, two up here and that just makes it kind of do this. And then if you add two here, uh, it's not really going to go anywhere, but that's fine. And then uh, you're going to do four here. One, two, three, four. They'll be stopped by these signs. And then we put four more here. And that brings it out to these signs, and that stops it there. And that's it. That's that's how it's supposed to work. But this is, this is what currently happens uh, if you're in the boat at this point. You kind of slowly come to here, and then it grinds to a halt just about here. And it doesn't really get much better than that at this point. Uh, it does pick up. I am not touching the thing at all, but then it sort of dies here and then slowly lands on here. And then that's, that's about it. That's what's going to happen. So, um, like I said, I think what I'll do is I'll, in between videos, I'll try to, I'll try to come up with a, a way to make this work. Um, it's not going to look like this. But from the ground, uh, I, I won't, I'll try not to alter the cloud at all itself. I'll try to just do this. So, you know, worst comes to worst. And if you want to have it, something working that you can ride on here to get to that rainbow that we're going to build in another video, I, I think we can, I think we can figure something out. I, I, I think if we, we mess with this a little bit, add another, a third cloud, I think we can be in business. So and I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll try to work with that. And the last thing I really want to do up here is add, there's a two or four torches. There's one in each of these little nooks up here. And then on the sides, like in the middle, right? The third block down, we want to put it here. So it's like, there's these two uh, that are equal length and just put it on the top most one of those. And those are the only torches that are up here, believe it or not. And uh, so that's, that's, that's it. I've, I've looked at it extensively and there, there are no more. So this is our cloud and then I am Darwin 68. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.